Elsewhere, UNESCO held the Access to Information Regional Meeting of Information in Africa that brought together information commissioners, ombudsmen and other regulatory authorities across Africa. Among the issues highlighted during the meeting were the status of access to information in Africa, the implementation of access to information laws and solidifying institutions of information commissioners in general and the African network of information commissioners in particular. Speaking during the forum, Foreign and Diaspora Affairs Principal Secretary Ibrahim Korir Singoy stated that the government will partner with various stakeholders and UNESCO to ensure that citizens in various African countries get the right of access to reliable information. This session is very important because it ties into the African Charter on Human Rights, which talks about access to information as being a right, but access to information being uh, availed in relation to the confines of the national laws of the, of the countries. So it's very important for us to be able to ask ourselves how well are we doing as a continent in relation to access to information, but also to ask ourselves in relation to information, what do we use information for when we get access to it? More often than not, uh, we have seen that access to information has been focused around the needs of the media, but for us, we also need to look at access to information in terms of how it enables the citizens of the country and the citizens of the continent to be able to, uh, to take advantage of the rights that they have acquired as signed in the various treaties and charters that have been uh, acceded to by member states of the African Union. Access to information to all, including disabled uh, people or people having some disabilities, but also how to bridge the digital divide and the knowledge divide that we see between countries and sometimes even within a single country. Today, as we know, we live in an information-based society, in a knowledge-based society, and the foundation of this is information. And therefore, we want to tackle this issue and to strengthen existing laws, ex existing regulations to ensure that nobody is left behind.